guys, my name is Emma and today we're going to do a 30 minute Pilates session. So for today's class, I'm going to be using a pair of one kilo weights. You can uh, do the whole class without weights if you'd like, otherwise you're more than welcome to use a heavier weight if you'd like. So you could go up to two, two kilos or even heavier if you really want to challenge yourself. Uh, nothing else needed for today, just your beautiful self and your beautiful mat. Let's get started. When you're ready guys, jumping onto your mat, coming to the back of your mat. Have a slight bend through your knees, roll through your shoulders. We're just gonna tuck our chin and start to roll down one vertebrae at a time. Good, when, once you get down to the bottom, you can wave side to side. Releasing through the hamstrings, releasing through your lower back. Good, and coming back to center, engage through your core, bend through your knees and roll up one vertebrae at a time. Lovely work, let's inhale, lift those arms up towards the sky. Exhale, swan dive over those legs. Good. This time interlacing those arms, so grabbing onto your elbows and just rocking side to side. Good. Lovely releasing here, rolling up. Good. One more time. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, tuck your chin and coming into another spinal roll down. Good, this time engage through your core, walk out into your high plank, tuck your tail under, puff up into your shoulders, engage through your glutes, draw your belly button up towards your spine. Good, we hold here for 10, five, four, Three, two, and one. You thought that, that was gonna be a really long 10 seconds, didn't you? <laughs> Just inhale, drop the belly, open the heart. Exhale, round the spine, chin to chest. So coming into your cat cow. Inhale, open. And exhale, round. Good, inhale, open. And exhale, round. Lovely work, when you're ready, tuck your toes under, coming onto your bottom, scooching up a little bit on your mat, bringing your feet in front of you. Sitting up nice and tall, bringing your hands by your legs. We inhale to prepare, exhale, come into your half roll back. So a nice C curve in your spine. Good, inhale, eh, hang on, what am I doing? Inhale, lower down, good. We exhale to lift up, there we go, got the breath pattern. Inhale to lower down, good. Exhale, we restack the spine, that's right. Inhale, drop down. Exhale, lifting up, good. One more time, inhale, lower down. Exhale, we lift up, good work. This time, coming all the way down, I want you to do a little pulse here. So we do a little lift, a little lower, a little lift and a little lower, good. That's it. We have five, four, three, two, and one, beautiful work. Lifting all the way up, let's roll all the way back down to the mat. Beautiful work, planting your feet into the mat. Press your lower back down into the mat as well. You've got a tiny little blueberry space underneath your lower back. We are, actually, grab onto your weights if you have them nearby. And bringing your weights over your head, we press that lower back down when you're ready. We inhale to prepare. Exhale, we bring those weights over our head and lift up, coming into our supine curl. Inhale to lower down. Tap those weights. Exhale, we lift back up, good. So you can do this without your weights as well. 
If you would like a little bit of extra support for your head and neck, you can interlace your hands and bring them behind your head. Good. Ensuring that you're pressing that lower back down into the mat and you don't have a big tunnel underneath that lower back. Good, lifting up. Good, and lowering back down. So bringing your ribs closer towards your hips here. Nice, and last one. Holding up, little pulses up now, and up, up, and up. Good, for four, three, two, and one. Can we do little ankle taps here? Side to side. Good, it's a little bit harder with those weights, isn't it? <laughs> Good. When you're ready, let's hold over to one side. Just pulse and pulse. Good. Nice, other side, pulse and pulse, pulse and pulse. For four, three, two, and one. Coming back to center rolling all the way down. Lovely work guys. Flipping your palms so the palms are facing towards your knees. We're just coming into a chest press here. So bringing those elbows out nice and wide and then press up. We press them down, then we press up. Good. Now, let's get our glutes nice and warmed up. When you're ready, we're gonna lift those hips as those elbows touch the mat. And then as those arms come up, we tap those hips down. So we lift up and down, lift up and down. Good, really squeezing through your glutes, keeping your core nice and engaged. That's it. We have five. Four, three, good, two, last one. Hold those hips up, just doing those arms up and down. Keep your hips nice and high, so keep squeezing through your glutes. Good, lovely, and when you're ready, keeping those arms out, try and hover those elbows off the floor. Let's do little pulses up with the hips. Let's go. Whew. Nice, we have five, four, three, two, and one. Beautiful work, slowly lowering those hips. I'm just gonna scooch down, it's coming off my mat there. All right, when you're ready, we are pressing that lower back down into the mat. Can we bring one leg up to tabletop? Bring the other leg up to tabletop, lovely work. We're coming into our dead bug with our weights here. So we're gonna extend one arm out and the opposite leg will come out and then we squeeze everything back in, good. We squeeze out, well we extend out and then we squeeze back in, good. Extend out and squeeze, making sure you're holding that blueberry size space underneath your lower back. If this is too much, guys, just bring one leg up to tabletop and that tap down. And you can just keep your arms up towards the ceiling. Otherwise, you can bring one leg, I mean one arm out as you bring the leg up and then reverse. Good, all right, let's come back to it. Good, really control, have that back to mat connection. Lovely, now if you would like, let's add on, can we do double arms, double legs? Press it out and in, you've got this, let's do three, keep breathing, two, that's it. Last one, beautiful work, can we just hold out, hold out there for five, four, Three, two, and one. Beautiful work. Drop those feet down or bring those feet back up into tabletop. When you're ready, we're bringing those arms by our side. Flip those palms. I want you to pump those arms down. Coming into your hundreds here. You can have your feet down on the floor if you'd like. We inhale for five through our nose. Exhale for five out of our mouth. Good. So I want you to think that you're pumping basketballs underneath your hands. That's it. You can extend one leg out, bring it in. Extend the other leg out, bring it in. Extend both legs out. Good, you can hold both legs out. Good. Or you can keep your legs down, whatever you fancy. 
You can obviously do this without weights as well. Good guys, we have five, four, three, two, and one lovely work. So working through the core, working through our arms at the same time, how awesome is that? All right, when you're ready, I want you to extend those legs out nice and long. We are going to do a chest press, lifting up and down, lifting up and down, up and down. So three times, then bring your elbows in towards your side. We're gonna roll up, really press your belly button down into the mat. I want you to try and stand up here without touching the mat. Then we're gonna lift up and down, lift up and down, lift up and down. Good, bend through your knees. Let's roll back down, coming into your chest press. Three times, three, two, and one, beautiful work. Bring those elbows in, press that lower back down into the mat, try and stand up. Good, elbows are narrow. We lift up and down, tuck your ribs under. Good, bending down. I'll show you, so show you a modification now. So arms out wide, press up, two, and one. Beautiful work, elbows in. All you need to do if you're modifying is sit up. We lift up. Down, up, down, up, down. Beautiful work, slowly rolling all the way down. Arms out wide, we press up and down, up and down, up and down, elbows in, roll up. Good, try not to use your hands, I know it's hard. Up, down, up, down, up, down. Beautiful work. This time you're just dropping your weights down. I want you to bring your hands down to the mat coming into a modified burpee. You step back into your plank. You bring your feet out nice and wide. I just want you to tap your hands together, bring your hands back down, then step back. Up, up, tap, down, down, down. Good, really opening up through the legs here. If you would like to advance, you can do a little jump back. So bend through your elbows, jump back, Jump up, lift up, good. Back, up, back, up, good. Back, up, let's do three more. Two, and last one. Good, can we just hold in this froggy squat? So you're looking like this, good. Can we lift up an inch, down an inch? Up an inch, down an inch, good. Oh, for five, four, three, squeeze those glutes, two, and one, just hold it down, hold it down here for five, four, three, two, and one. Beautiful work, bring those hands down, stretch out through those legs, give your glutes a nice little shake, holding onto those weights, rolling all the way up. Beautiful work, roll through your shoulders. Take a deep inhale and exhale, release, beautiful work. When you're ready, let's bring our feet out nice and wide. We are going to take our weights over to one leg, then we lift them, lift them up to the sky, and then we come over to the other leg. Good, so coming into a lateral lunge here, making sure your toe, your knees are tracking over your toes, lifting up and coming down. Lifting up and coming down, good. So you're sticking your bum back. Good, you should feel a nice little stretch through those inner thighs. Lifting up and down, good. Up and down. Now, when you're ready, we're just gonna go side to side. So we just press down and down and down. If you wanna add on opposite arm to foot, other arm is going up towards the ceiling. So you're getting like a tricep press with that elbow as you lift it up towards the ceiling. Tricep extension, I should say. Good, keep your core on for four, three, two, last ones. Beautiful work, Whew. shaking out. When you're ready, you're bringing one of your legs behind you, 
coming into a curtsy lunge. So nice and turned out position, tuck your tail under. We come down into that curtsy lunge. Oh, you ready for this? Right, we come down into a curtsy lunge, then you either bring your leg out to the side or you're gonna bring your leg up and have a nice little crunch. Let's bring those arms into it too. So arms come up above our head, we bend down into our curtsy, then we crunch, bring them down. We lift up, whoop, and down. I'll show you that modification. Up and out to the side. Up and out to the side, good. Up and crunch. Really engage through your core here, guys. Focus on a spot in front of you that's not moving. Relax your shoulders, keep breathing. Good, so working through the whole body here. Really working through the side, side of our waist, our glutes, our legs, our arms, everything. Let's do three, two, good. Last one, hold it up, hold it up. Doesn't matter if your leg, arms out, no, your leg is out like this. For three, two, and one. Lovely work, bringing that leg back behind you, coming into your curtsy again. Just little pulses here. I want you to create a diamond shape with those legs. So you should be showing me your inner thighs, good. Squeeze those glutes. You can bring your arms up and out if you'd like. For a little bit of an extra challenge, you can bring them above your head. You can open and close. Good, for four, three. Keep squeezing those glutes, two. The last one. Beautiful work coming up, Whew. shaking it all out, awesome work. Okay, so that leg that was just coming out and up, we're gonna bring that leg behind us now. Coming into a 90-90 lunge. So those hips are in line with one another. We are going to bend down into our lunge and then lift up. We bend down, lift up, good. Now, as we bend down, we're gonna bicep curl and then lift. Bicep curl and lift. Good. So there's arms extend as we extend those legs. <laughs> Good. Bend and extend for four, three. Good. Two. Last one, hold it down into that lunge. Can we extend the back leg? Bend it back into your lunge. Extend and bend. Those arms are extending out into that tricep extension. You've got this. Let's do four, three, two. Last one, hold it back. Flip those palms up towards the ceiling. Pulse it up and up. Bring those shoulder blades together for four, three, two, and one. When you're ready, flip those palms so they're facing towards one another. We bring the foot in and press it out. Bring it in. Press it out, good. So tap and out, tap and out. Good, so your body isn't moving here, it's staying nice and still. The only thing that's moving is that leg and those arms for five, four, three, two, and one, extend it out. Flip those palms again, pulses up for five, four, three, two, and one lovely work rolling through those shoulders, shake out through those legs. Whew. Fantastic work, guys. When you're ready, we are, we'll do the other side in a second, but first we'll do a fun little interlude thing. <laughs> All right, when you're ready, bending through, actually, let's do the other leg. Bending through the leg that was at the front, so the stabilizing leg. When you're ready, we are going to lift that arm of the leg that's out. We're gonna bend through the elbow, lift up, and then we're gonna rise up. That other arm is coming up as well, all right? So the arms are doing kind of the opposite thing. We bend, extend, and then we lift up. Keep your tail nice and tucked under here so your pelvis is nice and tucked under. You're squeezing through your glutes. Your body is really still apart from those arms and your torso that's coming side to side. Good, lifting up, good, and up. Let's do one more. 
and up this time. Can we just hold down there? Good, can we just bend and extend the elbow? Bend, extend for four, good. Three, two, oh, I'm getting cramped, and last one, hold it out. Can we just pulse it down and down? Good, keep squeezing your glutes for five, four, three, two, and one. Nice work, lifting up, lovely work guys, taking it straight to the other side. So extending the leg out, other leg out nice and long, bending through the other leg, bringing your weight down by your side. We extend the arm up, we bend and extend, then as we come up, we lift the other arm. So it's really nice and controlled here. Good, if you're using a quite light weight, give yourself that resistance. So you might wanna grab on to some heavier weights for this, if you'd like. And try not to rush it, don't let, I mean, no matter what weight you're holding, don't let the weight weigh you down. So really control the lift and the lower. Good. That's it. Coming over. Good, and one more. That's it, beautiful work. And then we come back. We extend and bend, extend and bend for four, three, two, and one. Extend it out, can we just pulse it down? Pulse it down, working through your oblique. Good for five, four, three, two, and one. Coming back up, oh, awesome work guys. Shake out those legs. When you're ready, we're taking that curtsy lunge little thingy on the other side. So. Bringing your feet nice and turned out. We bring the leg behind us that we're going to be mobilizing. Let's just get into the legs first and then we'll get the arms into it. So bending through here into your curtsy and then you're either extending that leg out to the side or we bend, engage your core, crunch it up. We bend down, crunch it up. Good, let's work those arms. So bring those arms up above your head. As you bring that leg up, we crunch down. Bend and crunch, that's it. Bend and crunch, or your bend, extend. Good, bend, extend, that's it. Keep your glutes nice and engaged here. You're nice and zipped up through the core. Use your breath, bend and extend for four. Good, three, two, last one. Can we just hold it up? for four, three, two, and one. Nice work, bring that leg behind you, coming into those pulses. So, find your proper positioning, tuck your tail under, bend through your legs, we pulse and pulse. You can bring those arms up, good, and down. Good, bring those arms up, nice, and down. So just playing around with a different arm, Sequence for these pulses, good. Whew, let's do four. Ah, <laughs> three. Two. Good, and last one. Beautiful work coming down. All right, now that leg that was in front will now be in front for these lunges. So making sure that you're doing the other leg for your lunges, you're not doing the same leg. Alrighty, when you're ready, coming down, tuck your tail under, squeeze through your glutes. We bend down into our lunge and lift up. We bend down, lift up. Good, bicep curl and stretch. Bicep curl and stretch. Good, or hammer curl, rather I'm doing a hammer curl. <laughs> Good, really engaging through your biceps, squeeze through your glutes. We have four, three, two, last one, hold it down, little pulses here for five, four, three, two, and one. When you're ready, we extend it back and sweep it forward. So tricep extension, Bicep curl, we extend the leg and bend. Good, extend 
and bend for three, two, good. And last one, can we hold it back? Flip those palms up towards the ceiling, pulse up and up. Good, keep your core on for four, three, two, and one. Flip those palms, we bring the knee and the arms in, press it back out, in and out, in and out for four, three, two, last one, hold it out, flip those palms again, we pulse for five, four, three, two, and one, lovely work, rolling through those shoulders, through those legs, rolling through those legs, <laughs> shaking through those legs rather, when you're ready guys, tuck your chin under, roll down one vertebrae at a time, beautiful work. All right, bringing your knees down onto the mat. Um, I am holding onto my weights because we are going to use them, just one weight actually, for this next little section. Now, the weight is totally optional here. You don't have to use the weight if it's too much. That's totally fine, you can do the whole thing without. All right, when you're ready guys, we are going to extend the left leg back and we're going to bring that arm out into, um, out to the side. When you're ready, you lift up that leg. I want you to sweep that arm underneath the other arm, really balance here, working through your oblique, and then lift it up back out to the side. Then you crunch that knee to your elbow and extend. Good, we come under, good, press and then lift up, and then we crunch. Good. Under, extend. So it's like you're threading the needle. Press and out, good, two more. Keep that arm hovering off the mat here. Extend, good. And last one. Out and extend. Good, can you just drop that arm now? Can we just pulse that leg up and up for five, four, three, two, and one. Draw it in towards your nose, lift it up, round and lift. Really control it. You are extending and flexing through the spine here, but you're keeping your glute nice and engaged. Not just whacking the leg up for three, two and one lovely work guys roll through your wrists if you need oh tell you what i am nice and sweaty <laughs> all right other side straight away so extend the right leg back long lift that arm out to the side lift your leg up when you're ready we sweep that arm underneath hover bring it back crunch that knee to the elbow Hover, good, it's really controlled, really slow here, keep your core on and crunch. Good, crunch, you've got this. All right, two more. Out and crunch, good, last one. That's it, and crunch, extend the leg, Drop the arm down, we pulse that leg up, controlled. Good, for four, three, two, and one. Right, knee and, knee and nose towards one another and sweep up, control it. In and out, in and out. For four, good, three, two, and one. Good, beautiful work guys, when you're ready. Knees are underneath your hips, I promise. We're nearly done. We make sure you're in a nice flat back position. Tuck your toes under, draw your belly button up towards your spine. Whew. We inhale to lift, exhale, tap those knees down and lift. Tap down and lift, good. That's it, keep going, we have five. Four, three, two, last one. Hold up, little pulses up and up. 
Good. We have five, four, three, two, and one. When you're ready, press those heels back. Come into your pike. Come into your bear. Hover those knees. Press back, pike and down. Pike and down. Good. Keep your core engaged. We have four, three, two. Last one. Just hold it back. Beautiful. This time, press your left leg down onto the floor. Lift that right leg up. Oh, when you're ready, we're going to sweep that leg forward towards your right elbow. Press it back. You bring it in towards your nose. Press it back. Bring that knee to your opposite elbow. Press it back. Good. Right elbow. So same elbow. Press it back. Nose. Press it back. Opposite elbow. Press it back. One more time. Right. Back. Nose. Back. Opposite. And back. Good. Stretch it up. You can bend through that leg. Open. Whew. And then lift up. Beautiful work. Oh, let's come down. Let's roll through those shoulders. Are you ready for one more set? Let's do it. Okay, I am so sweaty. All right, guys, when you're ready, hands underneath your uh, shoulders, tuck your toes under, draw your belly button up towards your spine. We lift those knees up. This time, I just want your knees, you to touch your knees together, press back out. Touch your knees together, press back out. So working through your inner thighs. Good. That's it. Speed it up. So we press, 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 press. Good for five, four, three, two, and one. Hover those knees. We lift up into that pike. Hover those knees off the mat. Pike and hover. Pike and hover for three. You've got this. Two. Last one. Oh, we'll do another one <laughs> and press back. Beautiful work. Plant that right leg down. Lift the left leg up towards the sky when you're ready. Left knee to left elbow. Press it back. Knee to nose. Press it back. Knee to opposite elbow. Press it back. Oh, gosh, gosh. <laughs> knee to same elbow. Press it back. Knee to nose. Press it back. Knee to opposite elbow. Press it back when you're ready. One more set. Same elbow. Back. Nose. Back. And opposite. And back. Coming all the way down. Drop your knees. Bring your knees out wide. Big toes together. And stretch your arms forward. Just relaxing down here on the mat, guys. Taking a couple of deep breaths here. Really relaxing your forehead down on the mat. I'm not going to do that because <laughs> I'll get all my makeup on <laughs> the mat. It's not a good look. <laughs> and also it's hard for me to lie down when I've got a mic. So you guys just relax. Really stretch those arms nice and forward and sink those hips down towards your ankles. Good. Nice, guys. One more breath here. And exhale. Just let everything go. Lovely work. Rolling all the way up. Tuck your toes under and come onto your bottoms. Beautiful work, guys. You're all done for today. Have a quick little stretch out if you need. I literally have sweat dripping down my forehead. <laughs> Hopefully you do too, too. I hope you enjoyed that session and I will see you very soon. Thanks for joining me guys. See you later. Bye.